Hey y'all, it's Anime Game Man. Today I'm going to be reading the first episode of Watashi. And I gotta say, let me just put this, get this out of the way. I relatively enjoyed a good amount of content that this anime provided, at least the first episode so far. I mean, at the very least, it had good jokes. It gave me a few laughs, like, there was this instance in the anime where one of the characters, which is Hana, was eating all these sweets. And then you have a joke from one of her friends say, if you eat too much, I wonder if you're going to be either chubby or muscular in the future. So it did have a few good jokes, and then I had another good joke where the, the mother showed up, and then she was yelling at Miyako for feeding Hana and the sister character all these sweets and then you see her tied up with like uh with like fucking um these bed sheets and these pillows and those were also pretty funny so when it came to like comedy instances this anime did pretty well as far as moe animes go it had more unique jokes than other moe animes did so i gotta give it its props when it comes to the story writing department it's a relatively done well in those portions but so far there are a few things worrying because its main character Miyako is kind of a creep and it kind of passes it off as something that's light-hearted or sweet but it's really not because there's a scene where Miyako's little sister invites her friend Hana over and already you have Miyako just oogling all over the friend. And then she says creepy shit like, oh, can I patch you? And then I was like, oh man, that, that, that's just kind of creepy. And then it takes a creep factor further when there was like this sequence where she did manage to get Kamintana to be in like this maid outfit. And then you see her trying to like take pictures on the bottom area where obviously it's Penny. She's trying to take pictures with the panties. The anime didn't explicitly say it, but come on now. It's, it was really obvious, and those scenes were like, okay, this is getting kind of kind of creepy. Kind of creepy. And the anime did kind of have the whole police joke where Hannah didn't want to call the police, but that was just one instance. And the other scenes, it kind of never went back to that, and it didn't really take the whole topic seriously of... You know, an older person trying to, like, take pictures of a younger person. And that kind of creeped me out on something that could have seemingly been pretty sweet. And it, seem, it seems like it's going to be something reoccurring, too. At least going off of the end of the episode. So there's that. So, yeah. And then again, it had those same creepy jokes where Miyako's like, Oh man, I can keep on fearing sweets even 10 or 20 years later. And then I was like, come on. Like, this anime has the tools to be fucking good too. Because, I mean, at the start of the episode, you have a scene where Miyako's falling asleep. And then her sister wakes her up. That was a pretty fun swing with like a um, jumping tackle. And there's a scene where... She was going to eat her French toast, Miyako, and then it's all gone. Then she actually used like this mixture made by her sister, which was a sweet scene. Then it, she was going to say it had like too much sugar, and she's like, oh, too sweet. And those scenes were sweet and adorable. It's just any scene that has Miyako, Ugo, or Rohana's like, ah, it's like, it just feels kind of cringy, you know? Just, just related to real life, if like an older boy or girl were like, try to do that shit to like an older, I mean younger girl or boy trying to like take pictures of them in inappropriate spots to try to touch them and just, you know, if you kind of think of it that way, it kind of becomes less fun. I mean, don't get me wrong, the characters at least so far, at least Hana and the sister Miyako, they're, they're pretty nice. Just Miyako herself, oh no, 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 I just can't. Can if she's one of the MCs, so that kind of kills the mood, at least for me, when it comes to this first episode. So, from a story and character standpoint, if they don't involve Miyako, it's good. The issue is Miyako's one of the MCs, so that kind of lowers my enjoyment of it. 
and animation is actually pretty pretty well utilized. And like whenever there was like the scene where Hana, not Hana, I mean Miyako was trying to get this suit for Hana when she's running super fast, and that scene was actually good because her running super fast actually was well animated by the animators and made the scene funnier. Or when you had the little sister jump on Miyako. Because of the scene was so well animated, it actually made it funny. So, or when it showed this sequence where between Hana being buff or fat, when you had the sister character talk about what the future of the Hana could be, because all the sushi eating she's eating, those are pretty good too. So, at least the animators in the art department they utilize the visual quality pretty well to their advantage. It's just the writing staff kind of hampers the show a bit. So there's that. Sound was pleasant. It did its job. And I'd say my overall rating due to all these reasons, I'm going to rate this first episode a 5 out of 10. Really, it's, it's still average because even though I had those creep scenes, it gave me a few lasso. But, I'm going to give it probably a another episode or two and if it just keeps on doing this whole Miyako being a creep for like the next episode or two I'm gonna drop this as quickly as possible but you know the potential is there and this enemy could potentially improve maybe hopefully because I mean the jokes that made me laugh I felt that they were pretty good as for recommendations, I'd say so far, I would only recommend this to people that really, 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 really like Moe anime. And that's about it. For everyone else, you might just want to step aside and from this anime and just go for other stuff. But for me, I'll see if there's any potential here so far. So yeah, those are my pretty much my overall thoughts about the anime. I really hope... Like I said, I really hope it can improve itself for its second episode. So anyways, guys and gals, comment out your thoughts and let us below in the comment section. Rate the video, subscribe if you want to see more reviews and reactions, and I'll see you guys later if you subscribe for more. Alright guys and gals, bye bye.